there's shallow stacks with especially with the straddles. Um, Antonio bought in 100k. He's got 81 right now. Uh, Francisco had a lot of big hands early. He's up 20k right now. Nice. Um, Jonas really hasn't even played a hand. Uh, Jonas Wood, he, he's in the one seat. He's an artist, a uh, very successful artist. Makes paintings. He's down over 3k. And he really hasn't played a hand. Uh, Antonio's in the two seat. Francisco in the three seat. Jonathan in the four seat. He's in for 29, so he's down 11k. Nick in the five seat is in for 40,000. He's up 13k. Uh, little Antonio, Soflo Antonio in the six. He's down 3,500. Armenia Mike doubled up uh, through Phil Helmuth. Oh, nice. And so Armenia Mike yeah. is up 9K right now. Phil Helmuth is still in for 10K. So Phil Helmuth's up uh, 5K. He's been up and down. He doubled at one point. And uh, Randall has been up and down as well, and he is about even now. So we got Antonio against Phil here. Antonio Esfaniari with a gutter. Phil Helmuth with... Look what we have here. With I trips here. Oh, no. So Antonio bet the flop and Phil called. Antonio with trips now on the button. And he's gonna, looks like he's gonna just call again. Oh, he takes it back. And this is the battle we've been waiting for right here. Phil Helmuth against Antonio Esfandiari. Right. Two of the most famous, most accomplished players in poker history. Battling on the felt right here on Live at the Bike. Phil with the best of Antonio right now. Which usually it seems to go the other, the other way. At least that's what Phil would say. And look at this. The river is a four. <laughs> Antonio gets there with his straight. And Phil Helmuth with trips. And Antonio checks. Did I call? It or did I call it? And look at this. Phil Helmuth is going to value bet his trips here on a four line board. Antonio Sfaniari has a straight. As Sfaniari checks it to trap Helmuth. Helmuth, the guy that's usually doing the trapping, gets trapped now, was trapping, gets trapped on the river, and now Antonio is going to Hollywood and put in a check raise. For Phil, this feels like a lifetime of punishment coming from Antonio. And an all in from Antonio. He puts in 40K. And now Phil has to call off his 10K. Can he get away from this? Would Antonio Esfandiari dare check raise bluff all in against Phil Helmuth? I think he would. There's a lot of bluffs here, potentially. Clock. No, I just kidding. Is that Francisco? Francisco. This is the battle we've been waiting for. Phil Helmuth against Antonio Sfandiari, two of the most famous, most accomplished players in poker history. And Antonio Sfandiari got lucky on Phil Helmuth, and now Phil Helmuth is deciding what to do. Phil has over 10K back. He went for thin value in the river. Wow. And that's what happens when you try to thin value bet against a really good player. I didn't player. want to raise you on the turn because I thought maybe you were drawing dead. Antonio is not giving much away here. It's pretty much just uh, shuffling chips and darting his eyes around. Uh, I should have taken the aggressive line against Antonio. I should have popped it on the turn. It's like Antonio Esfandi already knew where he was at. He, he knew that Helmuth had a seven and would value better the river. The Maybe a six and a five, you're going to a four. <clears throat> Phil doesn't like to fold after he gives these kind of uh, hand analyses. to go. Phil Helmuth, the greatest, making a terrific <laughs> fold. And look at Antonio's, uh, he's just doing a little there angle there, acting like he had my nothing. My distance, but I misread my hand. No. 
I swear. I believe you. And I actually I have it. This is so nuts. What? I thought I had Ace Four. Turns out I actually have Ace Five. Holy crap! Wow. I had an Ace Five. Well, I guess that throws all the commentary out the window. <laughs> <laughs> So Antonio so claiming down, that he was bluffing with ace four, he but he actually had ace five and had a straight, so he actually claims to be have accidentally made the best play. Right. I mean, this has to be just like trying to push <laughs> film buttons, right? Maybe. <laughs> this is just one of the sickest kind of little angles here. Either way, Phil Helmuth made a great fold and a terrific fold by the 14-time world champion. Oh.